I am Melissa and I am here to hopefully help you save money each week at Aldi by helping you figure out what items have been raved about and you'll probably want to buy and occasionally letting you know which ones you don't. That doesn't happen too often. I throw in some tips and tricks and hopefully you'll come back and see me each week. We're going with some of the old favorites. The Thai coconut chicken, just in case you're new here, is excellent. The pork burnt ends are also excellent. The white wine pepper sauce chicken and the Korean style barbecue chicken are also excellent. The cookie thins and the toasted coconut, that is the favorite flavor. The chocolate chip is also very good. The calzones are delicious. Those are great to have in the fridge for when you're just starving. The Hawaiian stuffing, I absolutely love. I stock up when that's in the back and it's back. The St. Patrick's Day chocolate truffles. The packaging is just so cute. I love it. And the Lucky Crunch, also yummy. Look at all the yummy stuff in there. These two new flavors on the organic instant oatmeal sound delicious. The minty shamrock frappe. I definitely brought that home with me. Uh, their frappe mix kits have always been so good. Okay, you will love the pesto and love the smoked gouda. The mushroom run one, you're going to either love it or hate it. The kios, both of the flavors on the chips are very, very good. The maple spam, this is for informational purposes only. You do with it as you will, but I didn't even know they made that. The Lucky Charms on the dough is super fun and cute. They had cake pops, and I can't believe I did not buy any. I'm shocked. The poke bowls are delicious. Those are really, really good. These coastal table runners are super pretty. Definitely have that beachy vibe. The scrub daddy and the scrub mommy. My store was out of mommy, but they had the daddy. And we have these gorgeous, those are in glass jars. These um, botanical reed diffuser. Look at that price. Love this colorful multicolor flatware. That's really cool looking. And the Squishmallow Mystery Squad. I don't know what it is, but I'm sure when I was 10 years old, I would have needed that. The uh, puzzles, I, I stocked up, you know, people had no phone service last week for 12 hours. Get some puzzles and some books, because I would go crazy. This puzzle organizer, that's super cool. I wish I had the room for it. I, I love that. These uh, hair accessories are so pretty. They had some really beautiful colors. Love the scrunchies. Everything was so pretty. Look at the green cheese for St. Patrick's Day. Let me know if you try them. These 5 by 7 rugs, they are really nice looking. Look at that price. The cooked mussel meat, I love that they have just the mussel meat without the shells. The leopard cones, we all love the holiday cones. Of course, I had to buy some. And these stuffed pancakes I hear are really good. So I brought home the chocolate hazelnut. I'm sure my son's going to love that. And the shamrock and swirl came home with, with me. And that other one also sounds delicious. Just in case you are new, this is the red bag chicken. It's amazing. The two bite cupcakes are super cute and delicious. And they had the loft house St. Patrick's Day cookies. And the Marble Rye. Are you a Seinfeld fan? Do you remember that episode? Grab the Marble Rye. Thanks so much for coming and watching. Give me all the likes, comments, love that you can. I appreciate every bit of it. Have an amazing week.